Hello everyone, I thought I'd take a look at some satellite images which look to reveal Russia's Shahed-136 drone launch site. These are the drones which were sent by Iran and have often been used around Odessa. These images first came online on the 12th of October but seem to have slipped under the radar a bit but I found them today and figured I would take a look. As even though the images are a bit old, it will likely be the same base still being used. So this first image, we can see a lot of radars. First, there's a pair of radar domes, identified by the chap who put the images together, as being a Nebo-M radar complex. This is claimed to be able to detect stealth aircraft, including the F-35, which I'm sure is typical Russian twaddle. These appeared at this site before 2020. They show up on Google Maps images too, so this is a permanent fixture here. But much of the other equipment on the satellite image is new. Also identified a Casta 22 air search radar and at the centre an RLMS radar system. The RLMS is also part of the Nebo M radar system. Now in the centre, is a system identified as the 35D6M. However, I think that's a misidentification. I think the 35D6M is a Ukrainian system, not operated by Russia. Now at the top is the interesting bit. There's a few covered areas, likely for command and control vehicles for drone systems. Then, at the top right, a pair of white objects. These first appeared on satellite images between the 9th and 13th of September. These are very likely Shahed 136 launching trailers. So if this is correct and this is the site, it is very interesting to know where it is and where the drones are being launched from. And the big question is, can Ukraine hit it? Well, as seen here, it's 180 kilometers. So even with Atakums, it would be a big ask at the very edge of Atakum's limits. But it is within range of the Neptune missile, and Ukraine now seems to be using drones to target Sevastopol, and drones could easily reach flying from Odessa. What is notable from the site is that there didn't appear to be any SAM launchers. Now, either Russia wouldn't leave a site like this uncovered, so they must have had some SAM systems placed nearby to be able to cover it. So that's it for this video. I thought it worth taking a look at just where the Shahed 136s are being fired from. If you found the video interesting, please click like and subscribe. I'd appreciate it. Take care everyone.